In both matches, the fans came out in large numbers, but for different reasons. For the Sofa Parker match, they were out to see the famous Ismailia team from Egypt. And on Sunday, they were out to take a look at the new AFC Leopards. Sofa Parker failed to break down the well-organized Ismailia defense in the barren draw. Chances were few and far between, but coach Robert Matano says his game plan was scuttled by early injuries in the match. You can lose your dependable players in the first half. It's very difficult to recover. But Sofa Parker came out clean and very comfort, uh, confident. We came out well, and then we managed to continue the game well. To Ismailia, Sofa Parker was an unknown entity. They only got to watch them in the Super Cup match against FC Leopards a week ago. But still, players like Bob Mugalia and Patrick Petit Kagogo surprised them. They promised a different approach to the match in Egypt. In uh, Egypt, we, we will uh, play uh, maybe better. After no goals on Saturday, FC Leopard started slowly yesterday but got a result against ball players Banks of Ethiopia. Banks complained that they were intimidated on Saturday when they went to watch Sofa Park against Ismailia. The spectators were saying that we are scoring four, five and so on. So it makes our players psychologically depressed. Leopards have a two-goal cushion that might just be enough to see them through, but the goal they conceded in the dying minutes might come to haunt them in Addis. Both FC Leopards and Sofapaka play away in the return leg fixtures in two weeks' time.